Okay, before I start today's Retro Arch video, if you like what you see today, hit notification, subscribe and like so you don't miss out on upcoming retro emulation content here on my channel, just Jamie. That means you'll get notified every time I release a new setup guide, plus it helps out my channel too. So, around a month ago, I released a Retro Arch Ultimate setup guide and it was pretty popular. And at the time, someone asked me when the next version is going to be out. So, right now, as of around less than 24 hours ago, we have actually got a new version or a new release. This is Libretro RetroWatch 1.19.0. Now if we take a look at the change logs just here, you're going to find a lot of different fixes and everything else for iOS. So from the seams of it, we don't actually have any new cores, but I could be wrong just there. There's lots of new fixes on there and apparently save and load states using RetroWatch are significantly improved, especially on the higher end systems. So lots going on just there. Uh, as we can see just here, we got iOS fixes, uh, iOS TV operating system fixes, and everything else you really need. So I was actually gonna do a full setup guide for this today, but like I just said, around a month ago, I actually released around an hour's video on RetroWatch. So if you've not actually looked at that one, check it out, and I'll do my best in that to simplify things for the average person who's new to RetroWatch. And as we know, RetroWatch can be quite a complex system with many different options. I've done an entire playlist on RetroWatch from MAME to different systems such as PlayStation 2. What I'm going to do is just put the links in my description for that. And we can also turn RetroWatch into a really nice looking system. Again, if you're interested in learning about RetroWatch, check out my ultimate guide on setting up RetroWatch for beginners. And we can really make RetroWatch look like a fantastic front end system. Anyways, that's it for my RetroWatch 1.19.0 update video today. Uh, links are going to be in my description like I've been saying. Anyways, if you like the video today, hit notification, subscribe and like so you don't miss out on upcoming retro emulation content. Also, join me on social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and TikTok. But until next time, stay retro.